Good day, my name is Shoal and uh, I work for a company, company called Micrographics and we can be found on the web at www.mgfx.co.za Right, so the, uh, as you know, Lumion 11 has been released and I'll be looking at one of the um, new features of Lumion and in particular the orthographic uh, view effect. Right, now I've started up Lumion 11 and um, I've clicked on the create new option within the create new option you'll see um, uh, additional uh, screens here as scenes and uh, there's a lot of cosmetic changes that they've made with the UI and uh, which is uh, very welcome right so I'm going to use this um, building a uh, new project um, it's just a building that has uh, you know no background and it's just a very simple example um, alright so obviously uh, we can uh, you know move around here etc um, this particular model is um, a, a currently in in perspective so you can see uh, it's got kind of vanishing points and that now to enable this orthographic view you would go to the photo mode and add the particular effect all right so um, what you can see firstly these are the existing effects so if I do add uh, another one uh, it'll allow you to pick from the list and uh, this is the new one that uh, is kind of currently under feature featured um, all right so if I go in there and uh, I select that it's now added that as an effect um, it's also added the little menu bar within the the model now this um, menu bar if you enable the uh, 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 orthographic view effect um, changes to include the information of this particular uh, effect alright um, I'll, I'll go through that uh, in a minute but here you can uh, adjust the clipping plane uh, it's basically uh, where it uh, uh, cuts your model in the front um, and that's where it cuts your model uh, from the, the back alright so um, I'm going to just keep it uh, maximum and uh, this is a full color so um, you can when you enable the uh, the orthographic view it'll fill your background with white um, I'm going to disable that I'll switch it on in a minute right here you can um, you can have it uh, 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 3d that's the normal uh, views um, this is the the orthographic view so you set it to 2d meaning it's more kind of a technical for a technical traditional elevation or plan view right um, obviously you can zoom in and out and then also uh, you can change the heading and the pitch all right so the heading will be the uh, you know if you're looking at the elevations this is the south north east and such um, and then the pitch um, if it's kind of a uh, if it's set at zero that would be uh, uh, an elevation if the pitch is set to uh, 90 it'll be a uh, kind of plan view all right um, and uh, yeah so you can you can basically uh, set that if you enable this um, uh, if I go set it to an elevation uh, sorry you go set it to elevation like that you'll see you've got a, a kind of a white background uh, if you disable that um, the background is back to uh, what uh, um, a kind of a more colorful background all right um, and uh, so yeah you can turn that on and off uh, at a will all right um, okay so that's basically the the idea behind uh, the orthographic view you've got your little menu which set it to plan or elevation and you've got a little bit, bit of a, a, a clipping and a color filling that you can uh, manage here right obviously this is a view that you've now created and you can render that view uh, at a later stage right um, that's basically the orthographic view and the ins and outs of that this particular tool right thank you for watching and see you on the next one